You sit in a coffee place in the heart of Tel Aviv, minding your own business. Maybe you're reading a book. Maybe Harry Potter is with you. You order a cafe a fuch, a cappuccino. When the coffee gets to the table, you want to put some sugar in it. Surprise! On the little sugar pair, there is a portrait of Theodore Herzl. Huh? And in the back, a few lines about the guy who started the Zionist movement. It's you, Harry Potter, and Herzl sitting together for coffee. So you take another little sugar pair. Oh my God, it's David Ben-Gurion. And in the back, a few lines about the first prime minister of the State of Israel. Maybe you were heading to a world of fantasy, but right now you and your book are surrounded with all these great Zionist thinkers who are educating you about your Jewish heritage. Are you a bit surprised? In Israel, it is the story of the we that structures the story of the I. <gasps> the Anachnu is the key to understand the Ani. Now, Let's leave the coffee place and go to the movies. When you are watching an Israeli film, the same rule applies. Reality is crawling into the movie theater with you and it's going to be enlarged on the big screen. This isn't a world of fantasy. This is the story of Israeli society. The characters that you meet on the screen are a reflection of the Israelis sitting in the audience. Shalom, my name is Delit Reuchman. I'm an Israeli screenwriter and a film lecturer who specializes in exploring Israeli society through films. If you're curious to understand Israel and its complicated reality, come join my lectures about Israeli cinema. The answers lie within the subtext of our films. <laughs>